tell me, where is your maker now? Call him. Call down his wrath upon me. You cannot, for he does not exist. I am Corypheus. I shall deliver you from this lie in which you linger. Bow before your new god and be spared. Never! As you wish. I knew you would come. It ends here, Corypheus. And so it shall. Successful in foiling my plans, but let us not forget what you are a thief in the wrong place at the wrong time an interloper a gnat We shall prove here once and for all which of us is worthy of godhood You're not proving anything by talking Dragon, how clever of you. It will avail you nothing. You will fall as a warning to those who oppose my divine will. You dare to touch an avatar of divinity? If you desire death, you shall have it. As you wish. What do they call you? A Kunari? Your blood is engorged with decay. Your race is not a race. It is a mistake. I shall sear you from the very heavens.
I shall sear you from the very heavens. I shall sear you from the very heavens.
Let the skies boil! Let the world be rent asunder! allow you this victory. You and all the heathen barbarians shall burn. have walked the halls of the Golden City, crossed the ages. Dumat, ancient ones, I beseech you. If you exist, if you ever truly existed, aid me now.
Solas? The orb. I know you wanted the orb saved. I'm so sorry. It is not your fault. There's more, isn't there? It was not supposed to happen this way, no matter what comes. I want you to know you shall always have my respect. Inquisitor, are you alive? Then it's over. How lovely. And you live. I can breathe again. And the sky is healed, healthy, whole. There's just that left to remember. Looks that way. What do we do now? We go back to Skyhold. A moment, my lady. My agents have found no trace of Solus. He has simply vanished. If he does not wish to be found, there's likely nothing we can do. But I will keep looking. It's odd that he would just leave without a word. You said he was upset about the orb. I can't be the only reason. Now that Corypheus has been defeated, we have a moment to stop and celebrate. Afterwards, you will be busy. Every noble in southern Thedas is clamoring to meet you. The fighting's over. Why do they want to meet me now? <laughs> You're joking, yes? They wish to bask in the glory of your victory, hoping that some of it will rub off on them. 
Everyone knows Empress Selene owes you her life and her throne. A thousand problems remain. And your opinion will be sought on each one, whether you wish to give it or not. <laughs> oh, now they're lining up to meet me. Such is the way of things. Previously, you were an upstart, a fearsome Kunari in charge of rebels and heretics. Until Corypheus revealed himself, they could not see the single hand behind the chaos. Once he did, they knew. A magister and a darkspawn in one creature, the ultimate evil. Now you are the only power left standing. Enjoy the evening while you can, Inquisitor. Imagining it, or do we have a moment to breathe? Corypheus is definitely gone. I was there. You should hear the stories they're telling in the barracks, the pride in their voices. Some of the soldiers have requested leave to return home, but many would follow us still. You are proof that the Inquisition has made a difference, and that we will continue to do so. Our soldiers put their trust in you, Cullen. I appreciate everything you've done. I should be thanking you. You gave me a chance to... to prove myself. In your place, I'm not sure I would have done the same. I should let you mingle. I'm sure everyone desires your attention. Enjoy the party, Inquisitor. So, oh, demons, dragons, giant asshole vint on a big magic rock. You don't let it get dull, boss. Good stuff. How was that good in any way, Bull? We all walked away. Chantry folk are picking up what's left of Corypheus with a dustpan and a pastry scraper. It's weird. I joined the Inquisition under orders from the Den Hasrath and stayed because Corypheus was an asshole. Now that it's done, I've got no orders. For the first time in my life, I can go wherever I want. Got anywhere in mind? If it's all the same with you, I'm pretty good right here. Anyway, the only place I'm going tonight is back for more drinks. To us being alive, and the bad guys not. Ah, Anan. Finally got a party, yeah? A bit of fun for saving the world. It's the least Andraste's Herald deserves for making things normal again. Except for, you know, everything ever again. I mean, is this for us or for her? Or, you know, him? Because I was there and I still don't know what's real. Let the philosophers worry about that. Tonight is for celebrating. Still some things to do yet, right? Because I'm in no hurry to go back to... Val Royale. That's where I was. You mind if people still stay around? Or whatever? This is home, if you'll have it. <laughs> Shut it, you! I cry. I'm punching everyone. All right, enough of that. Is this a party or what? Raise them for winning! Big freaking heroes, Inquisitor. All of us. They're all happy. There's still fear. But you helped them all. You healed what was hurt. They don't want to forget what happened, even if it gives them nightmares. It would hurt less, but it matters to them. The 
fear reminds people of what they fought for. It gives the victory significance. It's part of being people. I know. I don't understand. But they need it. I, I think I could return to the Fade if I tried. I'm light enough to slip through. But I'd like to stay and help for a while, if that's all right. I can still help people here. It'll be interesting to see what comes next. Yes. Because of you. Thank you for letting me stay. Ugh, I should never have hired new caterers so late. Leave it be, Josie. Everything's fine. It is not! I'm so sorry. Nothing's quite as it should be. Uh, do you like the drinks? I I'm not sure about them. If you don't pause for a moment, your heart is going to stop. At least I'd be spared another incident. Oh, what a disaster. It was so mad that it was late. The invitation to our guests barely went out at all. And, and it was so wonderful to prepare for a small banquet instead of the end of the world. Do you know what everyone is talking about tonight, from commoners to kings? Us. Tedas is discussing the success of the Inquisition. You played no small part in our rise to power. <laughs> you had a role yourself, if I recall correctly. Truly, we will never forget those we lost. But for tonight, to victory. Enjoying the refreshments? Josephine sent all the way to the capital for the Petit Four. I love tiny cakes, and there are so many. Which should I try first? I would avoid the dark ones topped with gold dust. Deep mushroom and anise. An awful combination, but it's quite popular in Val Royale. I believe they call it the exquisite misery. Ole. Why did we save her again? To you, Inquisitor, for all you've done. So much to do, my dear. I'll be returning to Val Royale to organize the Loyalist Mages. The Empress requires my expertise during what is sure to be a difficult transition. But that will wait. Are you enjoying the celebration? Josephine was in a frenzy arranging it. As a matter of fact, I am. This is all for you, darling. Enjoy yourself. You've earned it. Go mingle. The night is still young. I can't believe it's over. It seemed an impossible task. Defy the Chantry? Build the Inquisition from nothing, defeat a creature that would be a god. And yet here we are, celebrating. So we should be. Defeating Corypheus was no simple task. He was so confident of his power, he could not conceive of losing. If he could, he would never have challenged me. And he would have gone into hiding. Yes. It worked out far better this way. I intend to rebuild the Seekers of Truth. To make us the order we were meant to be. That will take time. Meanwhile, I am free to remain with the Inquisition. I think back to how we first met. And here you stand. You are the Inquisitor. A symbol of hope and change to so many. And you are my friend. How did that happen, I wonder? I'm pleased it did. You are a great woman, and I will always stand at your side. I was passing through the hall this morning, and a serving girl saw me and squealed. Actually squealed, dropped her laundry and everything. Such a mess. She was completely breathless. You were at the battle with the evil one, weren't you? I didn't even get a chance to answer. She hugged me. Hugged me. 
This is your influence. That's what happens when you're a hero. Is that so? Must be why it's so unfamiliar. Mind you, I can't say I hate the notion of being the good to Winter. I suppose you can't all be evil bastards. The blacksmith said that, and he spat when we first met. I hope my father hears. He will shit his small clothes from shock, I swear. I appreciate everything you've done for us. So you should. Being appreciated is a nice change of pace, though. I'm also pleased to come out of it alive. I wasn't expecting that. You thought you'd die? Didn't you? The hero dies in all the best stories. Anything else just sounds so implausible. I've decided to stay with the Inquisition. For now. You will? Devinter lacks the presence of my best and only friend. It'll keep. All this pomp and ceremony. Can't top seeing that bastard Corypheus burn. No matter what happens to me now, I can say I was there. I helped you bring him down. And live to tell the tale. So now that you've saved the world, what's next? Hoping to put it all back together? It'll be a huge undertaking. If anyone can do it, you can. And I'll be right by your side. Lady Inquisitor, leaving your own celebration so soon. We've been through a lot, haven't we? I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name. Rainwall? Black Rain? <laughs> I deserve that. And even after everything I've done, we're still here. Together. But what have I done to deserve this smile? It is said that Corypheus woke after his long slumber and found the world gone awry. He fought to bring back those days of magic and shadow, to raise himself as a god and set things right. Now, we are left with a scar in the sky to remind us of what almost was. It tells us that a great victory against Chaos was won, but left the world forever changed. Consider the mighty empire of Orle, where Empress Selene remains on her golden throne. The civil war is ended, the elven resistance pacified, but it is said Gaspar yet plots his return from exile. How long before the Empress missteps and he raises banners once more? This fear 
hounds her every move. Fortunately for Selene, her gratitude towards the Inquisition has remained strong. Some claim she clings too tightly to the Alliance. Others know it is all that stands between her and defeat. The Grey Wardens of the South slowly rebuild in the months following the events at Adamant. They declare it time for the Order to emerge from the Shadows, to join the rest of humanity in fighting their ancient foes. Rumors abound that they severed ties with their leaders at Weishaupt, and that a bitter war now rages between them. What becomes of Hawk is unknown, save that all news out of Weishaupt soon ends. Does the sudden silence indicate a battle within, or something far worse? One month after the defeat of Corypheus, the Chantry names Leliana as successor to the Sunburst Throne. Given the name Divine Victoria, she first declares an end to the Circle of Magi. The Mages will now govern themselves. She opens the priesthood to other races, declares support for the Inquisition, and rededicates the Chantry to the principle of charity. Divine Victoria is controversial from the start. Several new sects arise, resisting her reforms and declaring her rule a threat to the faith. She meets with their leaders, urging unity. Miraculously, her words take root, and for now, the Chantry remains strong. The Inquisition's mages, the former rebels led by Grand Enchanter Fiona, are left with a choice. When Leliana disbands the Circles, they leave the Inquisition and reform the College of Enchanters as a new order. The College, they say, will allow mages of the South to gather in peace and seek new solutions to age-old problems. For the moment, it appears to be working. Mages are enjoying unprecedented acceptance throughout Thedas. And what of the Inquisition itself? Its military might has grown, now rivaling that of kingdoms. Fear of the Inquisition's army has become the true source of its power. I leave Skyhold now, knowing that power will continue to grow. The Inquisitor is a symbol to many, a leader of the changing world order. To others, she has become a target. They linger in the shadows, waiting for their day to come. When it does, the Inquisition shall stand ready. I knew you would come. You should not have given your orb to Corypheus, Red Wolf. I was too weak to unlock it after my slumber. The failure was mine. I should pay the price. But the people... They need me. I am so sorry. I am sorry as well, old friend.
your worship. I feel a little nervous having the woman who commanded our spies on the Sunburst throne. Like if anybody recites the chant wrong, she'll have them shift. I'm probably overreacting. But yeah, if you want to go out and find some trouble, I'm up for it. At your order. Liliana is to be divine. It will be strange to see her go. Given her plans for the Chantry, the months to come will be... interesting. with enough spies to know how often you piss. It will be difficult to return to Devinter after all this. I have a good friend here. You don't find those just lying about. Such is my lot. Just a little longer then. They've made an interesting choice in Leliana. Inspired by something, no doubt. I would find the proceedings entertaining were it not going to create a mess I'll have to clean up. Liliana is already turning the Chantry on its ear, and she hasn't yet been crowned divine. It's quite interesting to watch. I offered to remain as right hand, but she has other ideas. I wish her well, regardless. The Chantry needed someone like her. I hear your mages are looking to start a whole separate college of enchanters. Be interesting to see if they can avoid pissing everyone off this time. What's more important is there are still rifts out there spawning demons. I'm ready to kick some ass whenever you are. I refuse to sell to him, to his face. And how much did you need? Any problems? Has it? There's not much left we haven't punched in the face. I mean, we're in with Leliana, so we have no problems. It's the ones who piss her off who need to squirm. I'm staying, though. You find fun often enough. I'm not sure where else I'd be. Inquisitor. The Inquisitor.
I'm sorry, Cole, but with your gift, I fear that you might see the path I now must walk in solitude forever. This fate is mine alone. Indeed, I would not wish it on an enemy, much less someone that I once cared for. Though you reach out in compassion, I must now insist that you forget. I, I I'm... What, what, what were we talking about? I'm ready to help people when you are. There are still people who need help. I'm ready. Liliana knows the game. She'll move the Chantry forward while quelling the fears of the Faithful. And I feel only pity for those who might try to depose our former spy master by force. Dealing with one dead divine was difficult enough. We shouldn't overly worry ourselves, Inquisitor. After so much warring, even the most seasoned players of the game yearn for change. Sister Leliana will bring about interesting times. I've been many things. Bard, sister, left hand, and always because someone needed something from me. But I realize now that I am all these things, and yet, not defined by any one. I am now Divine Victoria, but to my friends, to you, I will always be just Liliana. Skyhold will feel empty without you. Valrayu is not so far away, and I can always use advice from the Herald of Andraste. Not to worry. I'll be here for some time yet. There are still things to put in order before I leave. Are you still my spy master? When will you need to leave? The Grand Clerics would love to bury me in ceremony while they prepare for my coronation. But there is so much unfinished here. A new spy master to appoint? And... Perhaps I'm not quite ready yet. When the time is right, I shall go to the Grand Cathedral for good. They can't know what they're in for. I wish you all the best, Liliana. Inquisitor. Ah, oh, there you are. I heard about the new Divine. I have to say, I wasn't surprised the Spy Master was chosen. She's quite a driven woman. I'm eager to see what she does. Now, what's next for us? I stand ready, as always, Inquisitor. Radiant as always. <laughs> 